to my channel. Today I am back with another awesome recipe for you guys. Today we're making this awesome buffalo chicken dip. It's perfect for a Super Bowl or any type of game night. But before I show you guys how to make it, if you are new to my channel, do not forget to hit that subscribe button. Join the family. Also, if you enjoy the video, give it a thumbs up. Why not? Just give it a big, big thumbs up for me. And without further ado, let's jump right into the recipe. Okay guys, let's get started. All the measurement, the ingredients will be in the description box for you guys. Here I have about three cups of shredded chicken. I use a rotisserie chicken for this recipe. You can use some chicken breast if you want, or chicken thighs. Here I have one cup of chunky salsa. I'm using the mild one. Here I have a cup of red hot sauce. You cannot make buffalo chicken dip without red hot sauce. One cup of French dressing, four ounces of cream cheese. I have a packet of French seasoning as well, which is going to make this recipe 10 times better. Okay, don't skip that seasoning mix. And also we'll be adding half a cup of mozzarella and also half a cup of sharp cheddar cheese in there as well. Of course you can put a cup if you like. But let me show you guys how I prep my chicken. To prep the chicken is pretty simple. What I did is basically cut the chicken, remove the skin, that part is so delicious. Y'all, I had to eat that right after, it was so good. What you're going to do is carve the chicken with a knife. Once you're done, you can use a fork to shred them thinner or you can use your fingers. But once you're done, you should end up with about three cups of shredded chicken. And if you wanna make more, you can double the recipe and yeah. Hey, before I continue the recipe, I would like to give a big thanks to everyone who joined the channel membership. I really truly appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. These are the name of all the members right now. And if you would like to be a member of the channel, all you have to do is join. The join button is by the subscribe button for those who might be interested. Check it out to see all the perks we offer only for members. Definitely check it out and yeah, let's continue. All right guys, in my slow cooker, I am going to place my shredded chicken right in. And next, I am going to be adding a little bit of ground black pepper, not that we need it. Now we're going to pour in our salsa. I'm using the mild one. Now because I'm using red hot sauce that's already hot, so no need for the extra spiciness because I didn't want this to be too, too, too spicy. Now we're going to add the red hot sauce and of course we're going to add in the ranch dressing in there as well. end with the cream cheese I'm using four ounces of the cream cheese make sure if you're using cream cheese it's room temperature nice and softened because that way you don't have to keep stirring it keep opening it while it's cooking okay now we're going to add the ranch dressing seasoning once you're done this is what you have I did went ahead and stir it I don't know where that clip went but I didn't show you guys when I was stirring it but once you're done stirring you're going to add your cheese. You can all, you can add all of them together, honestly. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm going to be adding in the cheese right now. give it a last stirring just like that also if you want you can sprinkle some cheese on top if you like but I didn't um not that it messes up the recipe by any means but once you're done 
you're going to cover this and let it simmer not really simmer well it's going to be simmer because this is a slow cooker but we're going to let this cook for about 50 to an hour and on high heat okay once it is done this is what you have but make sure you check in between just don't just let it cook without checking it check it here and there but you don't have to really sit there and slave this dish okay that's how easy it is to make so we're going to stir everything together and basically this is our buffalo chicken dip so easy so delicious this is a crowd pleaser right there y'all no effort needed to make this it's going to come out so good i hope you guys try this out for a super bowl or any game night like i said thank you for watching be sure to like this video if you enjoy it also subscribe if you know and i'll see you guys on the next recipe bye